this is your girl, Tabby Kit Cat Woman, where the Kit Cats break, and I'm not fake. So now let's take episode two of The Sims 4 to the next level. Um, I know you guys notice uh, something different about episode two comparing to episode one, is that I have my webcam turned off. Um, right now, with this uh, particular screen recording, um, the webcam has been a little wonky lately, and also has been, um, well, uh, it's been kind of lagging here and there, and I don't know if maybe just the program just doesn't work that well with my webcam, but the screen recording on the other hand does work, so let's just jump right into it, and I will tell you guys right now that a lot of things have changed over the course of the months that I had last played. As a matter of fact, I actually played a little bit just recently. Um, and wow, that loaded pretty quick. Um, okay, so anyway, so I played a little bit recently, and I will tell you guys right now that there has been a change in the Fishbox family. Um, as a matter of fact, we've had two birthdays, and um, I decided to just play a little bit. Uh, I know, you know, a lot of you would want something to happen uh, upon the recording, but since I hadn't done an episode in a while, I was like, I kind of wanted to play recreationally for a little bit, and it happened, so anyways, so yeah, we had a couple birthdays, and surely enough, um, the two that had a birthday were the twins, uh, Mark and I had twins, and for those of you who did not know that, and for those of you who did not even see the first episode of The Sims 4, um, and I don't know why the game's glitching just a little bit, um, or it's actually kind of delaying a little bit, okay, there we go, uh, but as you can see, uh, so there's me and Mark, and then we have J Jack, and then our two daughters, Cyan, and Veronica, which actually, uh, both of my, um, both of my, uh, both of our children, um, were named after, uh, some good friends of mine, um, they were actually Instagrammers, um, they were my followers, as a matter of fact, one of them still is, and the other one, I hope someday she'll be able to come back to YouTube and be able to see what's been going on lately, but, uh, anyways, this one's Cyan, she's the one that actually ended up leaving, um, she's a social butterfly, and she's cheerful, so she's a cheerful sim. And then this one's Veronica. So, Veronica is a whiz kid and a genius. So, she is going to grow up being smart and may someday be like a scientist or something. So, I guess let's just get into the game right away. But yeah, anyways guys, I'm sorry uh, for those of you who would have loved to see um, Cyan and Veronica grow up. Um upon episode two or three, but I just, I really and truthfully could not wait. I wanted them to just go on ahead and grow up now, so that, it, but it's kind of hard to see the fact that, uh, they took toddlers out of the equation, because, um, in the Sims world, toddlers is very important, just like in the real world, toddlers is, again, also important. So, um, yeah, anyways, because thing of it is, is that with toddlers, after they grow up from a baby to a toddler, um, you know, it's important to be able to be, you know, being the parents, it's important to be able to teach them how to walk, teach them how to talk, and also potty train them. So, yeah, um, and it's, it's pretty hard, the fact that um, they actually took that feature out of the game. So, um, but... There was one other feature that they did take out, you know, upon the release of the game, but they decided because a bunch of a co complaints and stuff, they decided that um, they would add swim swimming pools and swimming wear, swimwear back into the game because originally they took that out along with the toddlers, and I'm surprised nobody has fought for anybody to put uh, the uh, toddlers back into the game. But that's okay. Uh, there's really nothing wrong with it, so... Now, I have the game paused, as you can see, um, and actually, don't mind the fact that Jack is sitting at the edge of my bed next to me, uh, mine and Mark's bed, excuse me, um, but, uh, anyways, let's see, let's get a better look at Cyan, 
before I do some playing here. I'm going to let me zoom in. Okay, there's Cyan. She's adorable. She is a cutie. Okay, now where did little Veronica go? I think that's her at the computer. And I, and I know these kids are going to be going to school, so... And for those of you who don't even know about episode one yet, I will tell you right now that actually when I first started the game, if you can see on the bottom right here, I'm going to move my cursor. If you can see on the bottom right here, um, our simoleon count, our household funds. Originally, when I first started, I think I only had like 40,000, but there is a cheat to being able to um, add simoleons. Simoleons is uh, the currency for the Sims. For those of you who did not know that, um, and there is a way to be able to add 50,000 each time. Control Shift C now opens up the um, the cheat panel. So um, this is the cheat you use to get uh, 50,000 simoleons, and you can use the cheat more than once. So as you can see, it's added 50,000 simoleons. So, and you can continue to add this as many times as you want. It doesn't really matter. That's how I made my Sims, uh, you know, stinking rich. So, anyways, let's add a few more just for the heck of it. But yeah, so the cheat is Mother Load. Load spelling L-O-D-E instead of L-O-A-D. So, one more time, and... There. Now, there are other cheats, too, in case you wanted to know. There's a cheat that's called uh, Testing Cheats On. It used to be called Testing Cheats Enabled True, but they changed it. So, and then, look, cheats are now enabled. So, I can exit out of that. And then, as you can see, let's see, let's go to her because that's we're on her right now. As you can see down here uh, where it says hunger and bladder. Now, sometimes if I, I feel like if I'm in like a hurry to get my Sims happy or something, like especially if I have more than one thing that's in the yellow, orange, or red zone and I feel like I can't take care of everybody all at once, there is a way of doing that. I go to the person I want to make happy and I um, hit shift and... Uh, right click. Nope. Yeah, shift and left click. Excuse me. Cheat need. And then make happy. And as you can see, it fills it up all the way. So I guess what we'll do is we'll do that with everybody just to start off the, uh, start off episode two. So let's go to Miss Cyan right here. Shift, left click. <laughs> need and make happy and then we'll go to uncle jack and he's on the bed so we'll rotate and the way i'm rotating guys is i'm using the uh, the sims 3 setting which um i'm glad they even added that in the game because the other way to rotate was like really really hard and i couldn't figure it out but this one's easier so it's actually in order to rotate uh up down left and right you use the control key and then press W for up, S for down, A for left, and D for right. So, anyways, okay, control, left click. Oh, shift, left click, excuse me, sorry. I had that control thing on my mind. Okay, make Jack happy, and then me. See, I'm very flirty right now, and there is actually a reason why Mark and I are both very flirty. So, anyways, shift, left click, need, and make happy, and then good old Marky Moo. As you can see, he is also very flirty, and, you know, there's a reason for it. So, anyways, look at that face, look at that grin after doing you know what so anyways shift left click cheat need and make happy so now everybody's happy so i won't have to uh feed anybody or put them on the potty for a little bit 
Um, but I tell you what, guys, whenever something does go down, whether it's energy, bladder, uh, hunger, fun, social, hygiene, then I will actually do, like, the stuff that you can do in the game, like, uh, for hygiene, you know, take shower and, and for energy, go to bed and, um, for social and that sort of thing. And also, by the way, something that they added back, uh, when The Sims 3 first came out, so, something that I thought was perfect that they added was, uh, brushing teeth. And actually, I would love to see, green or not, I would love to actually see what it looks like for the girls to brush their teeth. So, I am going to bring, uh, I guess since Cyan's not doing anything, I'm going to bring her in here, click on the sink, and brush teeth. Brush teeth used to not be an option for, like, the original Sims games. So, alright. And I guess I'm going to play the game. Turn the volume up just a tad. Come on, Cyan. I'm sure she's coming to the bathroom any second. Oh, she's chatting right now. She's chatting with uh, Uncle Sean and Mark. So I'm going to exit out of that. So that... Oh, also, by the way, guys, from the first episode of The Sims... I did, in fact, spell Sean McLaughlin's, uh, Sean's last name wrong. I spelt it, uh, A-U instead of O-U. But luckily, I was able to fix it and create a Sims. No cheats needed, so it's that like was, that. um, handy. Whoopsie. I don't know what just happened. Ah! Okay. Ah! Okay, see? She's brushing her teeth. Let's pause for a sec. Me up. Mm. I see some of the. Uh, I don't know why I'm in there. Probably. I don't know. I wanted to see just by looking at her. Oh. Aww. She was tall enough to spit in the sink. That's cool. Alright. So now that she has a minty breath, I guess. Um. Hmm. I'm always having the having everybody gaming, but let's see, what have I not done yet since the last episode? Uh, okay, how about this? How about everybody gets dressed and goes out? Okay, now that's creepy. Um, no offense to you, Septiplier, uh, shippers. Oh my god, are you serious? <laughs> <laughs> really? Ah, oh, that's hilarious. Um, just the way I paused it. Oh, I gotta take a, I gotta take a, I gotta, I gotta capture that. Cause he looks like he's holding Jack's hand. That's kind of disturbing, but also funny and kind of sweet. <laughs> I don't think that's what he's doing. I think what happened was, um, it, like as they're talking they use hand gestures so their hands are kind of going through each other but you know it does look like mark's grabbing his hand that's hilarious um i'm gonna take a screen a capture a shot of that that's hilarious um and i'm gonna post that on instagram after a while holy shit oh that's funny okay anyways um, and actually, I am going to be making Jack's, uh, girlfriend, as a matter of fact, she will be probably the next roommate I make, um, and actually, she's going to get her own room with Jack or Sean, and, um, I'm going to actually make them just boyfriend and girlfriend to start off with, because I'm going to have him propose to her, so I think that'll be a lot of fun. I don't know how to pronounce her name. I keep thinking, like, when I first saw her name written, like, uh, uh, S-I-G-N-E, I thought maybe it was pronounced uh, Signe or Signe or Signe or I don't know. I didn't really know how to pronounce it. But 
My mom said that she thinks that it might be pronounced Sing, but I haven't even heard Sean say her name. Um, as far as you know, as far as her name goes and pronouncing it, I'd rather pronounce it wrong than spell it wrong because a lot of people tend to have, um, you know, uh, what you call it, tend to have um, uh, pet peeves of people spelling names wrong and they think I don't care about that person if I spell their name wrong. It was like the same thing with Sean's last name. I was like, so what if I spelled it with like a one letter difference? I spelled it A-U. I was one letter off. Just one letter. And besides, and I think it would have been a cute way to, to, to change his name up a little bit. But because people were correcting me, especially one in particular, I was like, well, maybe there might be more than just that one person that would uh, really be peeved at me if I didn't um, if I didn't do anything about it. So, and at the time, I didn't really know how to spell his laugh name correctly. So, uh, his laugh name last name correctly and I and when I say laugh I was actually just thinking that when I spelled it with an a um, I don't know why I thought it was still pronounced McLaughlin but I was thinking oh it's got like laugh in his name because he makes people laugh and he's got a cute laugh himself so I was like you know that fits in perfectly so really and truthfully I didn't see anything wrong with a small little slight misspelling but anyways but yeah like I said so sing we Shoe will definitely be in here. I don't know her actual last name, so probably just for the heck of it, I will probably name her Sing We Shoe, and I will use her YouTube name as her last name. So she will be We Shoe. Um, anyways, and she will be the newest member of the family, and uh, I will eventually, hopefully in the next several episodes, uh, have Jack and We Shoe. Um, or have Jack uh, propose to Wee Shoe. Anyways, I really think that this is kind of awkward, but I know that they're just talking. But anyways, I uh, let's see. Um, I guess I'll get Jack to ch uh, Mark to change his clothes too. Let's see. Change outfit. Uh, let's put him in his party clothes too. Why the frick not? Let's put everybody in their party clothes. We'll all change at the same time. Uh, party, why the frick not? And, okay, we'll all change first, and then I'll have the girls change. So what a baby. Yes, an arp? And soon, Bafatamoy. Yes, it, it, it was just a glitch, but I, the morning. way I paused it, they looked Crazy. like they were holding hands. That's funny. Okay, looks like Jack's changed. Just about everything in Jack's wardrobe is um, mostly green. And looks like uh, Mark and I changed both at the same time. And look at Mark's booty. I actually took a screenshot a while back of uh, Mark poking out his booty the way he was uh, standing. Um, so I changed the girls' outfits according to what I thought fit their personality the most, so, alright, so, get off your mind, sweetie, and, okay. Who gives? Nada. Looks like I don't know why Mark got on the computer. Okay, now everybody's all fixed up. Let's all call a taxi. <laughs> I just had a little difficulty with the uh, next part. Um, I chose to go to a bar, which I thought was actually a restaurant, and it didn't really look very family-friendly because 
Um, they only had tables that could seat up to four people, which was really ridiculous. So I guess, it, it, you know, some of the tables were either set up for dates or some were like double dates. So I was like, oh, well, this isn't really like meant for kids. So, um, I don't really think I'm going to go anywhere because as far as Newcrest is concerned, uh, that one's like an open neighborhood for me to fill up. And then Oasis Springs has a few options of places to go to, but I don't think there's any anything you can go and eat. Um, so, I think maybe, well, okay, you know what? We'll go back to the Oasis Springs, and we will do something different. We'll go to the Desert Bloom Park, see what they have there, because it's awfully big. So, oh, okay. Glinda. Oh, that was weird. It almost sounded like somebody said, Glinda, oh, look, there's more kids. There's more kids. Oh, there's a kid. Oh, that's cute. I wonder what his name is. And where's his mama? His or her? Are you a he or a she? I mean, any number of the girls can have really short hair. Oh, you look like a girl. Hold on. Soren Canalis? Canals? Canals? I don't know. Looks like the girls may end up making a friend. Um. Oh, and something a lot of you may not know. Uh, I'm sure there's a good amount of you. Okay, here's somebody. Vivian Fenton. An elder. That's who she looks like. Uh, okay. Oh, look. Oh, hey, check it out. Oh, it's a little, uh, little coffee shop. I think. Uh, oh, never mind. It's a little mini bar. That's cute. Oh, Mark's got a guitar at home. I was actually, because he got a guitar, I was like, you know what? I am going to actually get him a guitar and have Mark learn how to play. So, anyways, um, but yeah, back to what I was fixing to say before I get into this game here. Uh, I wanted to mention to y'all that, um... I'm sure there's a number of y'all who probably didn't even know that this would actually work in The Sims uh, as far as relationships go goes, but, um, you know, I didn't think that it was possible to actually have, um, um, oh, what's the correct word? I guess, like, the homosexuality community into, uh, into the game, so, like, two men or two women, um, but, you know, I did some experimenting actually with the original Sims, and the only way you could do that is when you uh, change up the turn-ons and turn-offs in order to get the, you know, get one gender to be attracted to the exact same gender and so forth. And then once Sims 3 came along, you really didn't, you don't have to choose the turn-ons and turn-offs anymore. It's just all about, are they a perfect, max, perfect match for each other? So... You know, you can have two women or two men randomly meet each other, and if they like each other off the bat, especially, like, if the little flirt meter thing, if it actually goes up, if the flirt meter goes up, or the um, attraction meter, actually is what I like to call it, but if the attraction meter goes up or the romantic meter goes up, it means they have some sort of attraction uh, between each other, and that means that there's a possible chance that they could be a potential couple, so I was just saying that in general, and if any of my girls end up, end up gay, then, you know, a power to them, I'm not gonna judge them, although it doesn't mean I might not have a gay couple, anyways, but yeah, I just thought I'd let y'all know, so when it comes to The Sims 4, you don't really have to choose turn-ons, turn-offs, it's just a matter of, are they a perfect match, and are they attracted to each other, oh, there is someone else over there, this, uh, he might be related to the little girl. No, his last name is Poe. 
How is this little girl all by herself? Girl or boy, I'm not sure. Okay, well, I'm going to get straight into the playing because I want to see how this contraption works. I'm actually curious about it now. Uh, but before, I, let's see. I'm trying to figure out. I think I want, because she's a social butterfly and all, I want her to actually meet Soren. I want them to become friends. Uh, join the space adventure. Uh, oh, let's do a friendly introduction first. I want her to actually introduce herself. And I think that is a boy. It was the way I paused it. Oh, he's so cute. Soren actually might be a guy's name. I, th I thought maybe Soren could be a girl's name. I wonder what Veronica's... Oh, Veronica's over there. Let's see. Oh, cool! It shoots bubbles! So this is the first time I've actually done this part. I may play recreationally, but I haven't tried everything yet. <laughs> oh, are you talking to him behind that? Um, okay, hold on. I'm gonna... Okay, this is weird. Hold on. Uh... Can you chat here? Chat here. See, it looks like everybody's doing their own thing. Um, and actually, me being the mommy. Um, well, first off, I need to see what everybody's wanting to do um, as far as their needs goes. Um, okay, so certain people are hungry and need to go to the bathroom. I need to figure out. I think Jack's upstairs. And I am at some point going to have to... Um, do some renovations in the house and make things so much better. Let's see, do I have any bills to pay? Uh, nope, no mail yet, so that's good. Um, okay. So, let's see. I think because I'm down here. Oh, wait, I'm not Jack. What the fuck? Okay. Oh, I gotta see this moment. I, I can't, I can't. I have to record this moment. I have to record hugging my daughter. Oh, wait. Let me hug my other daughter. I want to hug both my daughters. But can I hug this one first because she's closer? I'm gonna hug my daughter. I wanna. I'm gonna hug and kiss every single one of my kids. So, um, friendly and kiss cheek. Used to whenever you kiss a family member, they always kiss the lips. But I guess they just decided that with most kids nowadays, you kiss them on the cheek. So, unless if you're like really like actual family. So. <laughs> okay. Come on, you two. It's like Veronica's watching TV. Come on. There we go. I may I may have my sim start dressing like a mom. Mm 
Where's the hug, you two? There, there it is. Oh, she did both at the same time. Okay, so now that that's done, looks like oh, Jack's meeting the potty. I don't know what was done, but okay. Okay, so this is actually. The girls are actually going to share this room. As cool as it is that they have their own bookshelf. Um, let's see. You know what? They have enough room for desks. Ugh, I swear, these controls. It's like I'm trying so hard to hit the, one, hit the right ones. Okay. So I think the best thing for me to do is... Um, hold on. Hold on, guys. <sighs> okay, one of these days, I am not going to edit any of that stuff out. People keep interrupting me during my recording sessions, and it is annoying me the fuck out. <sighs> okay. So, I think what I thought about doing was, I thought about maybe moving some stuff around, um, and adding an extra, uh, bed for, um, Sai, uh, Veronica, so that way the girls can share a room, so, um, I believe it's in build mode, if I'm not mistaken. <sighs> Alright. Um, it's a pretty good bed, actually. Oh, we're rich, though. We should be... Uh, you know what? I'm gonna get the princess one for them. They're gonna get really nice beds. I think... Uh... Let's do... Purple for Veronica for her. Uh, yeah. And then we'll do uh, uh well I can always change change the bedding later. Let's do pink. So they'll just have to get on the computers out, outside their room. This is too dim in here for them. There we go. Oh, yeah, that's perfect.
bookshelf. I mean, they don't have to have this one. So I'm here to make Sing, or however you pronounce her name. Hmm. Oh my god, that looks like her already. That was lucky. Okay, anyways. Don't like Jack actually, so okay. Uh, let's see, <laughs> perky walk mm -hmm. or <laughs> snooty walk. No, she's not a snooty swagger. Ooh. Ooh. Hmm. Oops, sorry. Give her feminine walk like me. Yeah. She's very feminine. Alright. Alright. Um. Let's go on ahead and choose her out before I do her aspirations. Let's look at her face. She's already looking more like Sing. Um. Her lips might want to be a little thicker though. She does have some pretty thick lips, um, or full, fuller lips. Lips don't look like that. I'm usually good with detail, but mm. 
make her nose a little perky. hard to make her, um, okay. If I had a picture of her, I could go by. You know what? You know what? Let's, let's give her one. I don't know if she has one or not, but in real life, but. Um. Wow. Let's give her. Give her a dolphin on her ankle. That's pretty cool. Okay. Um. She's not too built. Oh. <laughs> or saying, I know you're not that big. Let's put a little meat on her. Make her look average. Her butt's like really flat now. There we go. <laughs> I gotta give her a little thump. Couple hour delay here. Um, the Sims 4 actually had an update, so I had to update something. Or I had to update the game in order to continue. So, um, as y'all remember, I don't remember that. Oh, I think it's the light that's reflecting off of it. Okay. Anyways, um, as you guys could remember from just a little bit ago, I literally just, um, added a new family member. She should be around here somewhere. There she is. Oh, cool. I can hire a caterer if I wanted to. Oh. Oh, cool. It's family size. Oh, sweet. You can do party size. Up to eight. Oh, why not? Family size is for four people. That's four servings. And I need a party size because I have six people living in the house now. So, doesn't hurt for leftovers. <sighs> um, can you not get up, please? You're supposed to be cooking. Oh, she's washing the dish. That's so sweet. 
Okay. Um. Good to know. Oh, Choba boy. Ah, so so. <laughs> Hit it off, guys. Uh, Harp of compliment. Complimenter, Jack. Jeez, I need to read a cookbook or something. I don't know how to start. Frozen stiff, Jack. What are you doing? Uh huh. Defunit way? Ah, yips. Kabuni. Ah. Ah, flies and. And Jack. Uh, okay. No. No. Where are you? Where are you going? 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 Ah. 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 Oh, Sorry, guys. It's like, you didn't see that? Oh, yeah, she needs a cooking skill to, in order to be better. Uh, came out better than I thought. Okay. Um, hold on. What are you doing? Um, oh, yeah, that's right. Hold on. Oh, damn, they moved pretty quick. Uh... Hold on. Call to meal. Just the entire house. No. Not you. She needs to call the meal because she actually made it. So call the meal. And then everybody sit here to eat. Why are you eating over there? Stop it. Mark! What the frick is he doing? Can you not eat what I just put on the table for you? Can I grab it in this mode? I think I can. Oh, yes. If I move it over here to the dinner table, I'm smart. That way, people will actually grab their food and sit there. That's what I should do from now on. I should put the food right there. Okay. And why didn't you get up off your ass, Miss Tabitha? Um, excuse me. Can you? What are you going to do? Oh good, you're going to the dinner table. Thank you. Oh my god, guys. Um, My daughter, Cyan, is stuck under the stairs. I don't know how she even got there. Uh, unless a glitch made her fall through. I mean, I can't get her to get out. Look, watch. Weird. Uh, Chuba, Miba. She can't even get out. But I think I know how I can do it. I don't know if it'll work. Oh God, please work, please, please, to God work. I'm gonna try putting a door, or maybe an archway. Um, that is just really scary. Can you just imagine, like, your kid getting, like, literally stuck? Um, that's, like, stuck under the stairs. That's really creepy. Um, oh, I can put it right there. Oh, hallelujah. She should be able to get out. I am not about to let my daughter die. 
Oh my god, she's gonna be able to get out. She'll be she'll live. You can get out, baby. It's fine. Spino? <laughs> yeah, fruits. Ah, Orochi. <laughs> Please tell me you can get out. Oh, thank you, Jesus. Don't ever scare me like that. Oh, that's why she can't go. Okay, you know what? You're gonna eat first. You're gonna eat first. Um here's here's a plate. Just Wait. No, don't eat that. What the fuck? Why is macaroni and cheese right there? Oh, that's the macaroni and cheese, and I told my. <sighs> okay. Hold on. <sighs> and you can hear me peeing. Ah, <sighs> Onuba. Poor baby. <laughs> oh, see, everybody knows about the dining room table now, so I don't really have to tell them where to eat. I'm only going to play this for like another minute, guys. Um, I may continue to play it for a little bit right after I get done um recording, but uh, just know that I will definitely let you guys know what changes um like take thoughtful shower I think a thoughtful shower is where they're um oh what's the word the thing that, that that's for school um Oh, focused. They have to be focused. Uh, for her, focused. And her, also focused. So, I'll have to make sure that they take a thoughtful shower before they go into school. Um, but this is the weekend. So, I am gonna let her take a bubble bath. Because she needs one. She does need to pee, though. I just remembered that. Is there a toilet in here, too? Yeah. But yeah, guys, um, I'm seriously going to want to play this recreationally, too, on this particular, um, on this particular, um, profile, because I really don't feel like making another one, so, especially for this game, so I apologize, um, if you guys don't like the fact that I'll play a little recreationally, but I'm not the only YouTuber out there that has done that, so, um, you know, I'll definitely let you guys know what changes and whatnot and what what all you guys missed. So, um, I guess what I'll do is I will let you guys see Little Miss Playful right here. Um, take her little bath. There she is. Oh my god, what the fuck? Really? Seriously? What is wrong with you, Mark? Don't do the dishes in the air. Okay, guys, I am going to... Oh my gosh, I'm going to stop the video right here. Um, I'm going to have to see if I can't get Mark to wash the dishes in the correct sink. So, anyways, that's what happens, especially when they also, um, have, um, uh, for, I don't know if it's called Free Mind or, I don't know. Anyways, thank you guys for watching this video. If you liked it, please kick that like button where it hurts. Uh, leave me some comments. Let me know, uh, what you think. Um, I'm definitely going to be continuing this series no matter what. Um, and again, sorry for the delay on the series. I had never really meant to actually, uh, take as long as I did, but it, it, it happens. So anyways, guys, but thanks again. And I hope you enjoyed watching this video. So until next time, guys, peace out, love, and bye.
I swear, Mark. You've got to learn to wash the dishes in the correct... I mean, seriously, your daughter is sitting on the toilet. Taking a pee. And you, of all people, are about to do the dishes while she's in there? Hmm. Naughty, naughty daddy. You need, you, you need a timeout. 